I've always read that I should avoid pub- public USB charging outlets because you might be vulnerable to them slurping up your data rather than just transferring power. What do you guys think of this? See, that was an easy question to ask. I don't know why it took me two minutes to do it. Um, you know, I, I don't worry about this, John. And the reason is that I think maybe I'm wrong that Apple protects us because every time I plug my phone into a, uh, you know, a, like any data capable port, like on my computer, anytime I plug my phone into my computer, the phone asks, do you want to trust this USB connection? And that doesn't happen when I plug into a charging only USB device. It only happens when I plug in to a device that, that wants to pass data across the USB connection. And so to me, that's the litmus test. E- even like, I don't even have to answer the question to know that something fishy is going on. And so like, that's why I don't worry about it. I just plug in and I'm good to go. I mean, honestly, the thing I worry about more is what happened to you when you had that bogus charger in your car that was frying your devices. Mm-hmm. Like that I worry about with public USB ports. Like do I, how much power is coming through this? Is it, should I trust it? You know, if I could get like a USB surge protector, that might, I might be more tempted to use that on public ports than something that would like, th- there are those devices, right. That block like data connections or whatever, and turn them into charging only things. But I don't know that that would save you from a, 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 you know, the faulty electronics in it. So no, I don't worry about it. Do you worry about the, the data sniffers on public USB ports, John? Mm, no, maybe okay. I should. But yeah, as you <laughs> pointed out, so it, if you do a search here, and I just did it here, uh, US search for USB A data blocker. Okay. And actually, the first thing that came up is something from a company called Portapal. Okay. Um, and uh, for two of them, it's uh, eight bucks. So okay. basically what it's doing is it's eliminating um, the data lines. So it will right. never get to your okay. device. I mean, that's what they're doing. I mean, you could do it yourself. Uh, I, I, I wouldn't recommend it unless you're good with a soldering iron and, and clippers. But, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's the fair. intent of these. Um, right, right. And, and yeah, there's there's pen, plenty of them. And actually, the, the one I see here, it says, Pro- protect against juice jacking. I guess is another, uh, another term for all right. Okay, people try that, but um, yeah. I mean, th- that if you're worried about it, then then I I would think that's that's the, the way to go about it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I I I I don't for for the reasons I mentioned. I just don't worry about it. I feel like the phone's going to tell me. I maybe I'm being foolish. I, let us know if I'm being foolish. Feedback at mackeycab.com. 